Everyone wants a dog that has everything from energy to intelligence, alertness, and affection. This is why the Basenji can easily capture the hearts of people. They're one of the most endearing companions at home and in the field. They can be trained to be hunters, guard dogs, sometimes even to be cuddling buddies. The Basenji is one of the most flexible dogs to have. You can never go wrong in getting one. So, do you think you can get one? First, you need to know these interesting facts. Hi, welcome to Smart Dog Lover. If you haven't already, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to our channel for your regular dose of enlightening dog-related content. Today, let's look into the most interesting facts about the Basenji. How can these help you care for them? Tune in to find out. The Basenji is one of the oldest breeds. Did you know that the Basenji existed way back in 4000 BCE? Archaeologists found traces of this dog in paintings and artifacts. Other evidence even shows that the Basenji was given to Egyptian pharaohs as gifts. This is no surprise given their abilities. They can hunt with their masters, bond with them, and rule a whole civilization. These dogs get their traits from the wild. The standardization of the Basenji started in the 19th century in the Congo. People wanted to generate a dog who can herd cattle and protect the farm from intruders and wild animals. Did you know that they inherited their agility, strength, and intelligence from their wild wolf cousins? However, they don't tend to bark or howl. This makes them more outstanding as hunters. These dogs are medium in size. Many people think that these dogs are large creatures because of their wolf ancestors. However, they are medium-sized. On average, the male and female Basenjis grow from 16 to 17 inches tall and weigh 24 pounds. Some may grow smaller or larger depending on their parents and their environment. But this does not affect how amazing these dogs are. Basenjis have flat larynxes. Unlike their wolf cousins, the Basenji cannot bark or howl. Some people think it's because of their flat larynxes. However, this assumption remains inconclusive. There are probably other reasons why they can't bark. Experts keep pushing on that route to see why they have flat larynxes and if this really affects their ability to bark. Despite this, they can growl, yodel, and whine. They can still express their emotions, which is a good thing, so their owners can identify their needs and provide it. They are super friendly. Unlike other dogs, the Basenji is patient, loving, and sociable. They get along easily with other animals, dogs or not. However, since these creatures are natural hunters, they need socialization with smaller animals such as chickens and rabbits. Without it, they can chase these creatures and cause trouble. When it comes to children compatibility, the Basenji is rated 5 out of 5. They're outstanding babysitters, especially to older kids. These dogs can tolerate rowdy behaviors and can endure rough play. However, you need to teach your children how they should handle dogs. Make sure they don't tug their tails or ears or pull their hair. The Basenji might be quiet and patient, but if it gets hurt, it could display aggression. The Basenjis need experienced handlers. Unfortunately, the Basenji is difficult to train. Because of its independent-mindedness and high intelligence, they prefer working with authority. This is why an experienced handler is important to raise these dogs. Without it, the Basenji can grow up training their masters rather than the other way around. They can live in apartments. One advantage of getting a Basenji is their ability to adapt inside apartments, provided you give them a purpose. Like any other dog, they can become restless when bored. Giving them a toy or a chore can be effective to keep them occupied. Basenjis have high exercise needs. As you all know, these dogs are innate hunters. This comes with a high exercise need. If you were to own a Basenji, you need to commit time and effort to walk and play with them for at least 30 minutes a day. This is important to stimulate their minds and maintain a healthy body. 
They have a low shedding tendency. These dogs make outstanding pets for allergy sufferers because of their low shedding tendency. They have thin coats, which give people the ease of grooming. All you need to do is bathe them regularly, clean their ears, and trim their nails. These are important to keep their coat healthy and to avoid skin issues which could lead to discomfort. Bisenjis cannot tolerate the cold weather. Because of their thin coat, the Bisenji can tolerate the hot weather, but not the cold. If you were to own one, make sure you shelter them. During hot weather, keep them hydrated by giving them water. But when it's cold, keep them warm by giving them a blanket and an enclosed place to sleep. If you can take them indoors, do so. It's important to help them avoid contracting any diseases due to the extreme temperature. Visenjis are generally healthy. Like other dogs, these creatures are prone to several illnesses such as hip dysplasia, elbow dysplasia, hypothyroidism, kidney disease, and irritable bowel syndrome. If you were to own one, you need to schedule regular trips to the vet. This way, they can advise how you can keep them healthy. Usually, caring for a Basenji costs less, around $300 to $500 annually, but this amount can still be reduced with proper care. Remember to focus on their diet, grooming, and exercise needs. Other than that, they're easy to care for. Thanks for watching. Do you know any more facts about the Basenji you'd like to share? If so, please leave us a comment with your thoughts. Also, please like the video if you find the video is useful. Subscribe and hit the bell icon for more to come, and we'll see you next time.